So we're back. Another weekend is coming up. We're going out to hunt some birds again. So just gonna make the cabin warm again and then we're heading out. So I'm going to switch gear now and waiting for the for the morning to come up because it's still dark outside. So we'll see what's happening. Uh, see you in the forest in a while. So I just sent out Elmer to catch it. It was a grouse at 145 meters. So it'll go out to the pine over there and collect it. It's so cold, so I can't hold the camera with my hands. It's not that cold, but something in the air that makes the fingers to numb off. See if that. Don't think. He... Yes, here he comes with it. It was a perfect shot at 145, and he's making a. Well, as usual, a great job. Very great work. I was thinking of setting up the camera, but the quality isn't that good, and I will get a Tacticam in the future, but I have to save up for it. So there will be better movies in the future. I will also have a drone coming in soon. Look at him. Oh, tack, tack, tack. Oh. Look at that, pretty bird. I mean, sit, sit. Look at this pretty bird. This is a real, real beautiful grouse. So 145, this is a big one too. I think they're sitting hard today because it's not usual to get into 140, 145 on grouse. So uh, let's keep going. We're on the way to actually watch on the Martin trap. So, so this was fun. <laughs> happy dog, happy hunter. Ready to leave? There is a flyby. You got grouse there. The whole tree there is full of them, but the thing is that it's on a hen, so I can't shoot them. So, let's hunt on. So, uh, we shot a bird more. There were actually a whole pack, the whole pack came. It was over 50, 60 grouse that came and sat down on us when we were packing up the gear. And they mostly hens, but it was like the whole pack was almost hens. So uh, I had to spot out a grouse at 187 meters. So the pine over there, he's underneath it. So I need to go there with Elmer to catch it and uh, well see you in a while. So the road is long way down there. We're up here. So I'm gonna Oh I fell into a big hole. Almost drowned myself I think. But I'm going to release Elmer. Elmer sit I'm going to release him and he's gonna clear this one go so now he's going away he already knows where it is 
he saw it drop, so it can't be hard for him. For me, on the other hand, I already forgot what, which tree drove, where I was shooting at. But it's up here, and he's going to get that. Heat! Come heat! So he's coming with it here. <laughs> oh, tax Mickey! Oh, tax! Not really happy on him, but. Royal butt. Well, good work, Elmer. Took the bird. We have some training to do, but otherwise, I'm really happy. Really beautiful. You know, this time of year when the snow keeps coming and you can do this, hunt birds and just enjoying the nature, how it changes. It's, it's priceless. Priceless. That's all I can say. So, <clears throat> we've been thinking, now we shot two birds. The rest of the pack flew away at that direction, so I held the thumb. Uh, I'm going back to the yard, hang up the grouse that I shot because I want to, to keep the tails. And the next thing, yeah, well, I want the meat as well, uh, but uh, anyway, we're going back to the uh, to the to the yard and after that we're gonna pass and we're gonna do the same thing I did last time but on the upper side of it we're gonna we're gonna go around them so we're gonna meet them up because they flew away well we come from the other other direction then so collision course there we go I mean we need to do some scenery shots You still don't believe that this is healthy for you to be out in the woods? Really? I mean, really? Look at it. The snow is coming down, the sun is up. This is uh, Black Browse Bonanza. I just spotted one more pack, so we're going in here. This is a road beside my house that's going down to the creek. And they're actually just sitting a bit in here. So, well, if I come close enough, I'm going to try to film them for you. See if I can shoot them with the camera. So, wish me good luck. You won't believe what happened, it was the whole pack was actually sitting here, it was over 50 birds. But there's one still left there, and he's sitting right there. Well, I used to cut off the camera and he went, he dropped from the tree. But what can you do? Keep on hunting? Let's do what I told us to do in the morning go around and with the wind so so finally now we're going with the wind I don't want to go against the wind I don't want to go with the wind I want to go against the wind <laughs> so finally so we're turning around and we're trying to get the pack birds because now they are on the other side so see you later come on oh boy. <laughs> it's so they got them beautiful used to walk. well Oh 
kommer ut. So, still walking in the forest. I'm seeing them at the half or swamp or what you may call it. It's green and we call it mir. So, we're going slowly, slowly forward because it's the day, time of the day that they're actually. Well, look at this one. Well, you can smell them. So there's their probable close. But this is the time of the day when they're actually sitting up in the trees. Because it's soon end of these hunting days. So let's keep keep walking. awful to go in there it's not fun to go in the snow but here it's a ditch so I'm gonna follow that so let's walk down downwards of these this ditches to walk in tomorrow we're going we, sh we go by skis first time forward into the woods. I'm gonna see on the map where I'm at now. Because I'm soon probably back by the house. So it's starting to get dark. I got 400 meters left. I got up uh, Caper Cali again. This time it was a huge one inside the forest. And he flew out, but I didn't see in which direction he went. And it's starting to get dark, so I let him go. Now I'm tired. I want to eat food. I want to get warm. And I want to uh, feed up Elmer and get on it tomorrow again. Come on, Emma. Emma. So we're going to take this track out in the forest. We have a ditch here, so I think we'll actually walk the ditch out. If we get any grouse, it will be at the road because there's a lot of birch trees like here out in the forest. It's a lot of birch trees out at the road. That's why they are sitting there. Take my arm. Ooh.